Hey YouTube, it's Abby again. Christmas is 10 days away, so today I'm going to show you how I wrap presents using only five fingers. But Abby, how do you do stuff? Like, because you only have one arm. I'm not claiming I wrap presents really well, so don't get your hopes up. I'm just going to show you that I can simply do it at all. When you're wrapping presents, it's important to be in the Christmas spirit. So wear a festive shirt and a festive vest. I have a uh, wrapping paper, scissors. By the way, scissors are always right-handed scissors. Wait, is this a left-handed scissors? Oh, I have some ribbon. That one's, this is hard for me. Tape, and of course, I don't have any real presents because uh, if my siblings or my parents or my friends watch this video, I don't want to give it away. So I have a box of Kleenexes to wrap. I'm going to unroll the wrapping paper. I'm going to cut a strip like this. Okay, I'm going to use my paw to hold the Kleenex box because I need the whole thing to be steady. doesn't want to do the little sluzy thing that makes the scissors go really fast until a certain point. And come on, run! Run! Oh, I never did get it. Um, uh, this should be enough. Okay, this is going to be enough. Listen, my paw is super important in this process, and if I'm sitting on the floor, I use my foot, my right foot. That was creepy, and I didn't mean it to be. So this is where it gets a little tricky. I have to hold, you guys, watch this. I have to hold this down whilst I'm grabbing the tape. And I've learned over time to be able to hold the tape with, like up against my arm, and then rip, <laughs> rip it off like that. I don't know how to explain it. I just, I hope you could see it. Again, okay, that's good look. Look, we're, we've got a great start. Now, this is the part that I always like, I, I, it's, it's hit or miss. I know there are those people in the world that can make a beautifully wrapped present every time and I don't understand you. I think that you have robot parts, but I'm not one of them. So, I folded it. Okay, this is maybe the most tricky part for her. Hold it down while folding it over and now holding that piece up against the present and getting a piece of tape off. You know, if I was smart, I maybe would have pre-ripped off my tape, but I didn't, so. But you know, for effect, you can see how I do it in real time. Doing it live. It worked. No, those aren't the most beautifully sharp, crisp edges, but you know, we're working with what we got. Okay, other side. This is nice paper. I got this for $3.99. There are some things in the world that are $3.99 that are not this pretty. And I'm not talking about me. Stupid. <laughs> uh, you know, minus a couple little weird wrinkles on the corners, this doesn't look too bad. Now, let's put some ribbon on it. I think what I'm supposed to do is get a really long piece. Some of you are probably like, oh, this girl does not know what she's doing. You're right. Oh no, I don't have enough ribbon. Okay, well, I don't have quite enough ribbon to, uh, to make a full on thing that I was gonna do, but so I'm gonna just show you how I make a bow with what I have. I'm gonna put the ribbon down like this on the table and then put the present over it. I am employing my paw once again. Come round like this. I have a little grabber right here with my arm. And then loop-de-loo, just like tying your shoe, which I made a video about once. Try to finish the bow. Ah, this looks okay at best. <laughs> Check that out. There you have a semi-beautifully wrapped present. There's glitter everywhere. Well, that's it. This is, <laughs> thank you so much for watching. I hope all of you have a wonderful Christmas and maybe this helped a couple of you who might have a limb difference. If it did, awesome. I hope you get a chance to check out the rest of my channel. And of course, don't forget to subscribe.